Creative people, Rabbi Brian Jones here from RBJ Creative Studio, and today we're doing a tutorial on artboards. So, um, Creative Insights Season One, Episode Two will be in very soon, so you guys should stay tuned. So, um, today we are doing, we're learning how to transform artworks into artboards. So, when I started doing this work, I did it like a normal artwork without any artboard sections or anything. By the way, this is a vintage artwork, uh, cover art for um, a very nice drill song. Yeah. So I'm about to transform this artwork into art, an artboard so that I can create another um, workspace next to this um, um, artwork. So first of all, what you have to do is if you have any locked layers, you need to unlock it. And if you have any layers you're not using, you need to delete them so i have a couple of um, layers that i've turned off i won't be needing them so i'll just delete them from um from the work then you have to unlock every locked layer so it's it starts from here two three four five six seven eight nine then you unlock them i think we have two works here that i won't be using so let me just delete them yeah okay so this is the whole layers for the work after you've unlocked everything you move to layer then you move to new then you move to artboard and you click on it it'll give you um the name that's artboard one set artboard to presets you make sure you, you you leave it at the custom that's the width um at 6000 pixels and the height at 6000 pixels then you just click on okay so what you're going to see is there will be a change in your work right now if you are looking at this you can see that the gradient map has moved way down to the end or to the bottom of the layer so we have a color here that's the layer um oh you have to delete it because you don't want it it's like a white type of thing so if only you remember where your gradient map was placed you can shift the gradient map to that area and you have what you um, um how your work was earlier on so i just moved the gradient map and that's it this was how my work was and um i wouldn't want it any other way than this so Right now, as you can see, we have Artboard 1 here, on top here, Artboard 1. So you click on Artboard 1, or you right click um, um, on the Move to and you can see the Artboard 2 right here. So you have a plus sign on the right side, the upper part, the left and the bottom. So whenever where, wherever you click, um, um, extends the, the workspace and gives you a new working space. So I'll click on the right side here. And you, it will give me a new artboard so um guys this is simply how to i mean transform an artwork into an artboard so if you're working um let's say this this is um the front of the cover art let's say it's an album art this is the front you can also move the details or move the um the background and everything into the 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 artboard too as well all you have to do is just select what you want to move and um, i think that's it then you just right click you move on to duplicate layers you click on it and as you can see we have artboard one here so you click on artboard one and you select artboard two and you hit on okay automatically all the um background um um, um properties that you selected will shift to the artboard too and that's how it works that that's how it simply works so guys kindly subscribe to the channel like the video comment if you have any question this is um how to transform an artwork into an artboard and kindly anticipate for creative insight season one episode two season one episode two so that'll be it for today i'll make sure to um bring out a tutorial every week 
or every Friday or something like that. I'll I will start being very consistent from now onwards and I will need your help. I will need the questions coming and I mean if you want me to do anything just keep it coming. Yeah so guys that'll be it for today. Uh I'm out. <laughs>